Yo, what's going on guys? Kevin here. In today's YouTube video, we're going to be going over some back-to-school must-have accessories for Hypebeast. Um, this is a Hypebeast edition, and this is for all the people that are going back to school. Hopefully, you guys do go on to enjoy this video. I'm sorry for not uploading in three weeks. I was really busy, but that's besides the point because we're going to start grinding on the videos again. Um, but yeah, let's get right into this one. So I did gather a list of the things I'm going to be showing you guys today in this video. Um, I actually did gather eight things and wrote them down in my notes. Um, but first off, we had a vape hoodie. So, um, vape hoodies, you can find them on vape.com on their website, or you can find them for resale prices on StockX. However, they are, like, really expensive, as you guys can see. This one's $4.49, uh, um, and this one's, like, $5.15. This red hoodie right here and this purple one, I'm pretty sure you guys have seen people at your school wearing them. A lot of people have these hoodies, um, and it's just, I don't know, it kind of, like, it's kind of flashy, but they're really, like, nice and simple. If you just want to dress casually, now with, like, a bunch of different things, you could just wear your vape hoodie um, and be comfortable in it. Talking about one of these babe hoodies, one of my friends actually got a babe hoodie just because that was an idea for this video. I'm going to be showing you guys that right now. Alright guys, so my friend Everett sent me this, so shout out to Everett if you're watching this right now. Um, but he sent me the snap of his babe hoodie, and he put, um, I bought this jacket, it's good material and fits good. And if people can buy this for back to school, they definitely should buy it. It's a good buy, it's a little pricey, but worth the money. And as you can see right here, it's the actual um, babe hoodie itself. It looks really nice. Um, and I've actually seen like snaps of my friend wearing this and it actually goes hard with a lot of fits. So here's my friend Everett in the call. He's just going to tell you guys a little bit more about the vape hoodie. It was like $600 and the material's all good and shit. You should get it if you want to have a good jacket to go back to school. I've got compliments on it already and a lot of people like it. Um, if you're trying to be a hype beast, this should be your, one of your first purchases. Um, how comfortable, like, is it? What do you say? Uh, the material on the inside is pretty soft and comfortable, and the outside okay. material is, I don't think, it's like, I got something on it already, and the stain came right out. Okay. I don't know, it just, all around is a good jacket. All right, guys. Well, you heard it from my friend Everett. Um, but yeah, that's pretty much it for this first back to school accessory. Next up is a pair of Air Forces. You know, you can't go wrong with some forces. Um, it's not that expensive of a shoe. It's only like 110 bucks. Um, a lot of people actually do get new forces when they start high school again, like the new year. I've noticed that. You could either get yourself a pair of white forces like the ones that I have right here or a pair of black forces. But me personally, I'm not a big fan of the black ones. I don't know. I feel like black forces are for people that listen to young boy, though. But for real though, black forces, I don't know, I feel like you can't really match them with that much stuff. And the white forces, yeah, they do get like dirtier, um, faster. But there are ways of cleaning them and you could match them a lot more with other things. I don't know if you guys believe me when I say that people actually get brand new forces for like their next uh, school year. Um, if you haven't noticed that, just look at people's feet in the hallway when you walk. Not on like no weird stuff, you know what I mean? Just look at their shoes um, and you'll definitely see that they have some new forces. This is the second back to school high piece accessory. It's not really like a high piece accessory, but it's more like on a budget if you want to be a high piece type of accessory. The third thing that's on the list are these Supreme uh, playing cards. They're really small as you guys to see. Um, they're Supreme. And I actually have this box open, so I'm gonna be showing you guys what they look like real quick. This is a Supreme accessory that not that many people see. They're literally just little mini uh, playing cards, except that they're Supreme, so they're obviously better. But you could carry this little mini deck with you in your pocket at school and stuff and play with your friends maybe when you're bored or something, I don't know. It definitely could kill you guys some time though. It's not focusing, but it says Supreme right there in the back. As you can see, you could actually get eight of these decks um, for 32 bucks on StockX. You might not want eight, but I mean, it's 32 bucks. I didn't even see this one. They actually have a, a four pack, like a pack of four. Um, it's 20 bucks and there's only 18 left. So if you want to get these for school, you better hurry up. I'm gonna go ahead and put these cards away, moving on to the next accessory. Of course, I'm gonna bring it up because I made a video on it, but for number four, we have a Supreme backpack. Supreme has made a lot of backpacks in the past, so I mean, just pick any one of your choice. It's a Supreme backpack at the end of the day. People are going to look at you and say, it's a nice bag. They're going to compliment you. Um, they also are all really, like, really nice and spacious. I've realized that there isn't one Supreme bag that I don't really like. One that's really nice and simple that doesn't grab a lot of people's attention is the Supreme Canvas backpack. Um, it's going for $143 right now on StockX. Um, and it's just like this. It looks like any other backpack. It just says Supreme. It's just nice and simple. Um, honestly, this is a really nice camera bag if you guys are also looking for camera bags. If you guys are looking for like a more flashy Supreme backpack, then I would maybe get like one like mine, the Supreme um, SS18 backpack. I got this one right here. It's actually going for 274 right now. And I actually got mine for more. 
So I could have saved more money if I bought it now, but it's fine. So this is the Supreme backpack that I got right here. Um, I made a video on it. If you guys want to check that out, it'll be at the top right of the screen. But as you can see, like around the strap, it actually shows up Supreme all over it. So it's like more eye catching to people. Um, and I actually do take mine to school and I actually put my supplies in it, as you guys can see. Um, but yeah, you could use the Supreme backpack for multiple things. It doesn't even have to be school. You can take it out to go with your friends. It's just an overall really nice backpack that lasts, that would last you a long time. Definitely make sure you don't get a fake one though, because people are going to tell right away. Just trust me, if you're in high school and you're trying to, like, if you're planning on getting a fake one, do not get a fake one. Just, um, save up your money for a real one, I guess, if you want one, because people are going to make fun of you and I definitely don't want that for you guys. Next up on the list, we actually have a Supreme water bottle. It actually doesn't have to be a Supreme water bottle as long as it's in the high piece category for this video. You could probably get like a Kith water bottle, maybe an off-white one. Um, but Supreme is definitely a brand that has a lot of water bottles on StockX that they're reselling. Um, so there's this one that's really nice. It's in white. And I was actually planning on getting this one and this black one a long time ago, but I just didn't. I forgot why. And then they have this one, which I know is really old. I believe it's from the year 2018. Yeah, it's from the uh, drop in March 8th, uh, 2018. There's also these that you could get um, where it has like the cloth supreme around the actual uh, plastic bottle. They have it in black and in red. They also have these like with sticker designs. I believe they have a black one and a purple one. Yeah, this one and this one. Honestly, you don't really need a water bottle if I'm being honest. You could just have a, literally a plastic water bottle like the one I'm holding. Uh, this is just for looks, so I just say that you have a Supreme water bottle to have it maybe in your Supreme backpack for back to school. If you drink a lot of water though, these uh, bottles actually hold up more water than these regular plastic ones. I believe that was accessory number five. Now we're going to move on to accessory number six. What I'm about to show you guys is definitely not needed, but you could uh, get a chain from GLD from shop, uh, the gold shop. With the GLD stores, um, they basically sell chains, um, not real ones, obviously, uh, because like the prices are really low, like a hundred bucks. As you can see, this one's um, literally a hundred. Some of them are more than a hundred, up to like I believe five hundred. Um, but you could also buy like the real version. They have like these diamond ones, but obviously, if it's one hundred thirty-seven dollars, it's not going to be like the real version. It's just going to be glass. But it still blinks and it still looks like it's real. So, I mean, if you want to look good for school and impress maybe your crush or something, um, then I would definitely recommend the G.O.D. Shane. Shane, I meant to say chain, my bad. I actually have this specific one right here. And you guys have seen me wear it in a couple of videos uh, before. Um, but, yeah, you could choose, like, your different length um, depending on how, like, long you want it. Um, and here's a, like, a little quick video on it. It's just obviously, like, if you're at a young age, you're not going to buy, like, a real chain because you would want to save your money. Um, but yeah, if you wanted to like buy something for the meantime, then you could definitely buy this and it would definitely also last you a long time. Um, I believe this is what my first video was on actually. And it got a lot of views. So if you guys want to check that out, um, that would also be at the top right of the screen. I don't know why Julia just makes like your fit like stand out more and like it just shows like, it gives you more attention I feel like, I don't know. It just, it just looks nicer and it makes your fit look way better. So if you want to pull up Drippy and if you want to make like your fit stand out, you definitely know where to check out. Just go down to the link in the description and uh, all these things will be there and including the chains that I just showed you guys. Okay, so this next item uh, is depending on your budget. Um, so it's actually cargo pants for school because cargo pants are really nice. If you like dressing like that, then this is definitely for you. Um, you, could add, you could either buy your cargo pants from Zara and save yourself some money. Um, they have like a bunch of like different ones that are really nice. Like for example, these black ones right here. Okay, actually, no, not these. Um, they have some like these, for example. These are really nice, and you can match those with a lot of fits. But also, the other option that I have for you guys um, is getting cargo pants from Stone Island, which are really expensive. They're actually 800 bucks, but if you want to, I don't know, if you could afford it, then I would definitely go for it. The reason why it's in the high piece category is because Stone Island, um, a lot of people wear cargo pants with like Dongs, Jordan 1s. Um, and this is where they actually get them from so if you couldn't tell a lot of people get their uh, cargo pants from Stone Island and a lot of people get theirs from like random stores uh, that they could afford for example like I just said Zara uh, would be a good option I actually have some myself from Zara I actually have these right here I think from being from Zara though I wouldn't wash them because maybe they could shrink uh, but they look really good as you could tell this color you could definitely match it with a lot of shirts so you could wear these um, multiple weekdays when you have school. 
but if you don't already have cargo pants you should definitely get yourself some cargo pants for when school starts um but yeah moving on to the next accessory i'm sorry if i keep calling them accessories um it's accessory slash item that i'm doing for this video i know you guys saw this one coming the last one is actually going to be yeezy foam runners um okay so foam runners are really comfortable i know a lot of people say that they're really ugly and i know a lot of people that don't uh really like them but it's probably one of the most comfortable Yeezy uh, that has ever been made. They have a bunch of different colorways. They have uh, like some beige ones, some like dark gray ones, red ones. I seen them at SneakerCon and I seen people wearing them and honestly they didn't look that bad with the fit. So don't like, don't listen to other people's opinion. If you like them, just get them. I know foam runners are really expensive, but I heard a lot of people say that they're actually worth the price. They're kind of like slides, like you know when you walk around your house and you wear like your Nike slides or whatever. Um, this is kind of what it is. Um, it just keeps your feet comfortable, I guess. It has like padding all over it. I actually might get uh, a pair of these for myself because these are actually like really comfortable looking. I don't know. I kind of get it like when people say that they're like ugly. But I, I, in person, they don't look that bad. Also, this shoe isn't even about the looks. It's about how like comfortable it is. Pretty much wraps it up for the last one. Um, that's pretty much gonna wrap up today's YouTube video. Hopefully, you guys did go on to enjoy it, and hopefully, it helped you guys out with some ideas for back to school accessories slash items. Definitely subscribe if you haven't already for more cool videos like this one. If you guys haven't checked out my previous videos, I'll leave uh, the links down in the description below. Some of those, if you guys want to check those out. Um, but yeah, that's pretty much gonna wrap up today's YouTube video. Hopefully, you guys do have a good night day whenever you're watching, and yeah, peace.